We're at the IS continuing a discussion with the press conference that just happened, and we're with Ahmed Shahada, who is with in Italy with exactly. the International Development Law Organization. Organization. Yes. And it's um, the com the conversation was pretty robust, and um, you were involved in, in a lot of it. Uh, I would appreciate if you'd kind of give your background on what what you brought to the press conference. Okay, so. Uh, uh, my name is Ahmed Chahat. I work as a regional program coordinator and I'm a lawyer uh, with the human rights background. We work with uh, uh, many legal organizations uh, across the Middle East and North African region. We also, as an uh, intergovernmental organization, we deal also with governments and we have member countries uh, in IDLO. Uh, uh, our work in, uh, in, uh, in law enforcement in the region actually uh, 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 happened with, between the uh, civil society organizations that IDLO is supporting technically and financially in those countries and also the government. And, uh, and uh, many of the civil society organizations have been dealing in issues related to people living with HIV and K populations in those countries. A part to address the HIV in those countries, and it was an important part, is dealing with police and, and law enforcement with, uh, in those countries. Uh, many of our implementing partners have uh, a middle memorandum of understandings and agreements and protocols with the, uh, with the uh, law enforcement departments in those countries to train them and to work with uh, and engage them uh, uh, into the HIV programs they are designing. Uh, we frankly see there is a lot of progress between uh, uh, police and, and civil society in those countries uh, to respond to uh, uh, HIV. Now, do you use some of the police officers who have signed on in, in theory and in, in effect to pitch that to other groups? Uh, th uh, this is very important part. I mean, uh, uh, police officers, uh, as I was also uh, explaining to my colleagues, there is a human rights committee in each uh, in each uh, Ministry of Interior in uh, in the in, in, in countries where we work in. And uh, through this human rights committee at the at the Ministry of Interior, the civil society organization uh, are uh, well connected with them. They, they, they provide training to police officers on HIV and how to address together HIV. Uh, and uh, police officer, officers are appointed as focal points in those committees and uh, they can be peer educators to other police officers in their uh, uh, respective countries. So what are your next steps to, to move along this? This is very important. Next steps is always, uh, I mean, a larger question, but uh, uh, we consider more programming with police is very important. More training for police on issue and public health is very important. Uh, public health and public security, as uh, we uh, mentioned earlier today, that they are uh, one thing and one important, uh, uh, I mean, uh, tool to uh, address HIV. So uh, we need more programming on, on, on public health, we need more programming to engage with police in the Middle East and North Africa and uh, build the bridges between health and law. And w when you're talking about uh, learning what you learn, and then how would you replicate that in other communities? Uh, this is, that, is, is that what you're working on now? Yes, exactly. This is what we're working on. We're trying to build the bridges between country and another by a sharing of experiences through regional and international uh, consultations and events. Uh, uh, and, and for example, at the International AIDS Conference, we're trying to share these experiences between different police officers from different countries. So each they learn each other and they, they can share the experience widely. When you, when you get completely, your act together completely, and you bring it back to the United States because we need some help there too. This is this is exactly what we do. <laughs> exactly. Right, thank you very much. Thank I you so much. It. Thank yeah. you. Thanks a lot.